person came to depression because all the roadblocks were facing me, coming to me because of your criminal background. No, 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 no. To where I gave up. Lord, where are you? I don't understand why I am going through. For six years in a dark place, until I met a stranger, a somebody I didn't know at a nail salon, who believed in me until I could believe in myself. You know what she pulled out of her bag when I was giving her my pity party? A stranger, a tiny jar of mustard seeds. As I sat in front of her and gave her, woe is me, I don't understand where it is God. She poured it in my hand and I said, this is all the faith I have left. And she looked at me with a smile on her face and she said, that's all the faith you need. You don't understand, this is all I have left. And she said, that's all you need. You see, sometimes your problems stack up so high that they become your mountains. But she said, God didn't say kick the mountain. He didn't say push the mountain. He didn't say dig around it. He said, open up your mouth and speak to your mountains. And as I started speaking to my mountains, and I realized when the, the doors started opening, everything started opening, I published my first book. So 20,000 copies of my first book as a self-published author in the first year. Amen. You see, nothing is impossible. Do not forget those three things. 